mindfulness is a way of living. So meditating is not exactly something that you do once and you've learned what to do. It's for life. Science and research is showing that mindfulness is a practice that um, can be hugely beneficial to people in their everyday lives, to create space, to get to know ourselves better, to feel connected to others, to feel greater compassion for others. I think it can help in simple things in life, like decision making, sometimes by taking a breath and a pause, we can really start to prioritise a bit better and realise what can actually wait till tomorrow. We are so driven by the fast pace of life, especially in a city like London. It is very good to take a moment to reflect, pause for a moment. A lot of people are living with one foot in the past and one foot in the future. And I think that mindfulness can really help us to stop and be present in the present. We're looking for amazing things in life, like celebrity, fame and other things. But actually, the most important thing is to connect to the source of life that is inside you. And it's the secret of happiness. I really think it's wonderful what we're doing at St. Peter's, trying to bridge faith and mindfulness. They're not that dissimilar. It's based in a church, but it's not aimed at any particular faith or religion. You don't have to have a, a faith or a practice to come there. And it's looking at mindfulness in very different ways, from the classic breathing techniques through to mindfulness of music, mindfulness in eating, mindfulness in the body. What is mindful eating? How can you connect to the source of taste and uh, enjoy your meal and also enjoy life in the present moment? I know that we can cure so many things through the food that we eat and the way how we eat it. It's really inclusive and open to everybody, whatever age, whatever gender, whatever ethnicity, whatever faith or no faith at all. I specialize working with children with special needs, with autism, and um, I'm also very interested in the relationship between the child and the parent and the communication to explore their fragility and develop the strength. Music is a fundamental part of mindfulness and I think it can really help us to find our point of calm and our point of uh, ease and peace and for me music has been a wonderful vehicle for mindfulness and to find my inner being and I just wanted to try to communicate that love and passion for music that I have. This is an invitation to the whole world, and especially in Chiswick, to people who are coming to our courses and want to keep going, keep learning. So come, visit us and stay with us. We still want more people to have the opportunity to have this same enjoyment uh, through meditation. It's a great thing to be part of. This is uh, nothing but a treat, so I'm very happy.